Hey everyone, welcome to this series of videos on Firebase. In the last video, we discussed about what Google Cloud Functions is, why do we need them, and how they are an integral part of the serverless platform and technology. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to create your first Google Cloud Function on the Firebase platform. We are going to implement a Google Cloud Function that's going to convert a string to uppercase. We learn how to develop locally in Visual Studio Code and deploy the function to the cloud. One thing to note is to enable billing on Google Cloud Platform for cloud functions to work. So let's quickly move to Visual Studio Code. I have created a folder first cloud function and we're going to run the first command that is Firebase init functions. Now, as we've already set up Firebase, Firebase admin and Firebase tools in the previous videos. We won't be repeating that in this video. So Firebase init functions is all that you need. The first question it asks is, what Firebase project do you want to set up? So I've already created a Firebase project, hello, hi functions uh, for us. And that's what I'm going to select. We're going to use JavaScript and we just go forward with these. So as you see in the left hand side, we have a new file index.js and this is where all our code is going to go. The most essential part is requiring Firebase functions. This is going to help us uh, write these functions. And this function is also very important. Uh, this is where we're going to write all the logic. Now, if you want to know more in detail, this URL is where you're going to find all the intricacies and the nitty gritties. So what this function is going to do is the user can open a particular URL on the browser with a message and we're going to return that message in uppercase back to the user. So the first thing that we'll do is whatever message the user sends, we're going to capture it from our request query parameter and store it in the message msg variable. Also, if the user doesn't share any uh, message with us, we're going to just have a default message. So hello, fabulous, you fabulous LinkedIn learning users. It's going to be a default message and the next thing we do is going to send a status of 200 and send the same message that the user sent only this time it's going to be in its uppercase so we're going to call the uppercase function on it okay save it and we're going to deploy it using the command firebase deploy hyphen hyphen only functions. So this is going to take some time. At the end of it, it's going to give us a function URL. And all we need to do is go to that URL in the browser, give it a message or not, and see the results for ourselves. So one thing is uh, I created the hello hi world functions, the firebase project beforehand. And if you want to do that, this one, uh, you just have to go to console, uh, Google Cloud Console on Firebase, and it's pretty intuitive. So that's like a basic requirement. So as I said, we have a function URL ready now. Uh, so I'm going to copy this and move to a browser. And I'm going to pass a message of so hi you all keep learning okay let's see so here here we go we have it and in case we don't pass any message at all let's see what happens so this is the same message hello you fabulous linkedin learning users only this is an uppercase so uh that's it guys uh this is your first google cloud function deployed to the cloud uh, and uh, hope you like this video 
Thank you so much. In the next video, we're going to discuss uh, a more complex uh, application using Google Cloud Functions on Firebase platform. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.